Hola mga kapatid, happy Monday sa inyo ito pong News Room 5, live na live na live na live din po napapanood sa aming News 5 Teachers Facebook page. May YouTube na rin po kami kung saan live siya ang hashtag News Room 5 Live, NWSRM5 Live po yung spelling niyan. At hindi lang yun mga kapatid, sa www.news5.com.ph, be informed, get it on 5. At ang segment natin ngayon, eto, dahil napakaraming negang balita, umpisa natin yung linggo natin on a positive note at nagbibigay tayo ng pugay sa mga magagaling na tao na makaka-inspire sa atin. So this afternoon, ang kasama po natin, no, etap eh, natural lang naman sa licensure and nursing yes, exams. Isipin mo, not one, but two ang nadali niya at top po siya dyan. Let us all welcome Jeffrey Pelayo. Thank Gerald. Sorry, Gerald. may got the kamali pa. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I'm so sorry. I won't forget your name. Dahil I know, kayo na pa kami nagchichikahan na siya magiging pinakamagaling na neurosurgeon sa Pilipinas. For sure, alam ko yan. So, yung parang target mo? Neurology? Neurologist. Neurologist. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yan, grabe. So, basically, last Thursday ka lang nag, ano, lumabas yung results. Yes, yes. Congrats. How did you do it? Um, disciplina and faith. Gano ka, ka disiplina? Talk about your day schedule. Okay. Usually, I wake up 4 in the morning. I started off with Bible reading and praying. Gusto ko kasi I'm anchored in the Lord. Kung baga parang meditation yes, level. Yes, for 30 you know? minutes to an hour. Okay. Okay, and then after that, I jog in the morning para okay yung circulation. Endorphins. Oh, oh, oh. happy hormones. Oh, oh. Okay. Alam mo, doktor na doktor talaga. No? Ganun mag-isip. Kasi nga naman talaga, kailangan umikot nung ano, no? dugo mo. Yes, yes. Yan, oh. Pagkatapos, I eat, I eat a good breakfast. Such um, as? Avo ba ito? Charot. Uh, um, more on fruits and vegetables and then less of the meat. Yeah, so pesco vegetarian. Ang galing! Nakakainis. Just on top. And then, syempre, I go to the library as early as possible. And then, pag nag-aral ako, no distractions. Wait lang! So, 4 a.m., anong oras ka na nag-aaral kung ginawa mo ba si diet, seven. si exercise? Okay. 7 or 8. 7 or 8. Every day to? Um, except Saturday. Kasi from sunset ng Friday until sunset ng Saturday, that's a Sabbath for us, a Seventh-day Adventist. So, we don't do any secular activities. We go to church, we sing. And then we study God's word and extend community service. Wow! So rest for for 24 hours. Galing! And so you can rest your brain yes, too. Yes, because science and Bible talks about the need of the neurons to to take a rest. And, and that's important, kaya yes. diba? You don't also na nirecommend sa inyo lalo mga sojante ngayon na nuno nuno o kung nagaaral kung ano man na pinupurga niyo yung utak niyo. Yes. Kailangan yung pinahihinga niyo talaga. Yes, kailangan yun. Kasi Hindi ka umiinom. Hindi, no vices. I don't drink. I don't smoke. Uh oh. I don't uh, drink coffee. Gusto ko uh, natural. Hindi ka nagkakape. <laughs> Chacha ka ba? Um, hindi, masyado eh. Oh my gosh, hindi ka nag-ice tea? <laughs> hindi masyado. Masyadong scientific na ito. Approach na to guys ha. Too much na ito. Tsara, alam mo yung sabi ko sana. Kasi syempre, di ba, pag-inspiring ang story, gusto mo i-pattern yung sarili mo na, kaya ko yung 4 a.m. Kaya kong tumakbo. Oh my God, di ko kaya hindi magkape. At, pesco vegetarian, medyo tricky yan. Pero alam mo, it super makes sense. Okay, and, and then your Sunday, how is it like? Sunday, usually pag Saturday night and Sunday, socialization. I go with go out with friends. Galing! So, Until what time? Uh, basta hindi ako lalagpas ng 11. Kasi kailangan 11 o'clock, tulog na ako. Enough rest. May jowa ka. Meron, meron. So, Gali, paano yun? Tulog din siya ng 11. <laughs> tulog din siya ng 11. Because she's also 7th Adventist, so we go to church together. We have the same schedule. Okay, tama nga naman. <laughs> tama rin ba? Schedule, tama. Oh, Yan, oh, oh, tapos? Oh. Tapos, yung isa pang technique dun is, I evaluate myself every now and then. I mean, test. Test yourself. Hindi pa pwedeng basa ka lang ng basa. That's passive learning eh. For Alam me, mo, favorite kita, kasi lahat ng matatalinong ginest namin na iba na nag-top notch. Lagi sila, aral, discipline, ganun. Gusto ko, yung iniisa-isa mo kasi it makes sense. Why? Why you're like that, di ba? It's a habit kasi. Parang it, it, yes. yeah, parang it was effective for me since nursing. Kaya na-apply ko hanggang ngayon. Oh my gosh. And... And from nursing, you 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 knew you'd want you wanted to be a doctor. Yes, because I know that nursing will teach me to be extra compassionate, 
in to give extra may ganon, care. May ganon, uh, be. Parang, may pa-emotional, ano. Parang preparatory so, siya for medicine. So, let me guess, inaral mo yung five, ano, levels of intelligence. Um, ganyang level ba? Yung tipong kailangan physically fit, emotionally fit, yeah. mentally fit. May mga ganyan, eh, di ba? Spiritually fit. May mga ganyan, di ba? Hmm, kaya holistic. Yun yung holistic? Goal. Yeah, holistic. Kakainis. Baka nag-yoga ka rin. Trust. Hindi <laughs> masyada. Oo, oh, kasi Moral tumatakbo ka na, eh. Uh-huh. And then, um, you said you evaluate yourself. How do you evaluate yourself? Every when do you evaluate yourself? Actually, pag napapagod ako, gusto kong magsagot ng tanong. Kasi para na-excite ako magsagot ng mga tanong. To evaluate myself kung natutunan ko ba yung concept na to. Ikaw ba nagtatanong sa sarili mo? Meron kasi mga uh, like end of the chapter exam oh. or questions. Ayun. So, yun yung parang way ko to evaluate myself. Sobrang galing naman. Uh, and, and then, sabi mo gusto mo mag-doctor at the age of what? Bata pa lang ako, gusto ko na maging doctor. Oh my God, that's the, are you, are you, do you come from a family of doctors? I'm the first doctor of my oh family. Oh my gosh. And that's an inspiration. May pinanood ka bang cartoon o yeah. ano? Actually, si Ben Carson, yung pinag-usapan natin oh, kanina. Oh, yeah. yung pinakaunang nag-separate yeah. ng Siamese twins. Yeah, he's a Seventh-day Adventist. Oh, so kaya marami kaming yan, Ang exposure. Ganin. Sabi ko, if this person with a humble beginning can make a difference in the life of this family and these patients, gusto ko maging ganun. And you will be. I right? Pray, I pray. Oh, oh. How tedious is the process para because you were telling me earlier na mag specialize ka yes. in in neuro science, yes. right? Yeah, neuroscience. Aha. Uh-huh. And then how does how will that come about? Like, anong mga proses proseso yung pagdadaanan mo? Yeah, we have to take series of exams bago po tayo makapunta sa labas and then register doctor in the states. Tapos I apply for residency programs, training programs. Then it will be Doon, sa States. Doon. Then six years. Saan sa States? Hopefully, kung makapasok sa Johns Hopkins sa Baltimore, Maryland. Wow! Uh, yun daw yung pinaka-bongga, by the ay, way. Hindi naman. Ma- one of those. Tipo, <laughs> oo, yun, yun nga daw. Kaya nilang paghiwalay yung Science Twins. Ganun daw sila kagaling. So, cream of the crop talaga. Diba? Uh, so, after that, are you going yes, home com- sa Pilipinas? Yeah, I'm coming back. And I want to serve kasi the, the my hometown mas bate. Wala pa kasi neurologist do, wala pang mga specialist masyad. It will take them like 3 3 to 4 hours to transfer the patient to another bigger hospital. So yeah. To think I've been to mas bate a lot of times dahil nga pag election ano siya, di ba? <laughs> ano siya, hot spot siya or something. Yes. Pero alam mo yon, parang sana by now ma-develop na talaga natin yan. And I think you really push the way for that. So, it will take you how many? Sana bumalik ka talaga. Ah, babalik ako. Babalik ako. Like six to seven years. Kasi ibang level yung bayad sa ano, di ba? <laughs> Aminan na natin. So, sana bumalik ka talaga in six to sure, seven years. Sure. But That's I know right. naman, parang you're a man of your, kumbaga may vision ka talaga. So, so besides this, ano yung mga, so yung study habits mo, pinag-usapan na natin. Yung diet mo, pinag-usapan na natin. Pero how were you like when you were young? Young. Ah, yung parents ko kasi. strict ka ba? Sobrang strict ba? Nang parents ko, hindi. Yun yung isang bagay na I'm very thankful about. Kasi they're just supporting me. No pressure. I never heard them tell me, oh, you have to top this exam, this and that. Gusto lang nila, just enjoy life. Okay, pumasa ka lang, okay na. But, one thing talaga na hindi ko makakalimutan sa kanila, yung discipline. Four, four pa lang sa umaga, gising na kami lahat magkakapatid. We worship together as a family. Four. Four in the family. Iba, iba talaga. Then discipline for AM, gising na kami lahat, then we sing, and then we memorize Bible verses. And sa lugar namin, wala pa kaming electricity back then. So kailangan, you have to open the windows, magbabasa ka ng ganyan, and memorize this and that. Saan to sa mas bate? Mas bate. San Ramon, Uson, mas bate. Ganun, ganun ka, sabi mo, ganun ka humble ang beginning mo. Yes. <laughs> yes. Galing. Yes. Kung baga, you're not a city boy. No. Wow. Gulat na gulat ako when came to Manila. Nag-culture siya ka, <laughs> para, binastos oh, ka ba? Hindi, hindi naman, hindi naman. Hindi ba? Ikaw binastos sa mga classmate mo? <laughs> hindi naman, hindi naman. O oh, di ba iba rin ang kultura sa... Oo, oh, oh, ibang iba. Kasi I went to Cebu for my oh. high school. Oh. And then Mindanao College. Okay. And then Luzon for oh, medicine. Oh my gosh. Kaya ko sila. <laughs> okay, o oh, tapos. Paano seen, ka na culture siya? Um, kasi iba talaga yung college kasi ako. I was with 70 Adventist group of people. So, no vices, walang... Like, we share the same beliefs. Pagdating ko kasi dito, iba-iba eh. Iba? Oo, kaya... Pero, At pagdating mo rin sa states, lalong iba. Walang, <laughs> hindi rin sila nahihiniwala sa pinahiniwalaan yes, natin. Yes, yes. Kaya, ano lang, I, I just want to be different and then, um, different other people. Ayoko din mag-judge sa kanila. Of course. Ayoko din i-condemn sila. Yes, yes, yes. Parang ano lang. Ha, ikaw, as a disciplined person, para sa mga nanonood sa akin ngayon, shout out sa inyo, hello, Luzon, besides me, and then now, Middle East, I hope you're really enjoying our very inspiring conversation. Ano yung, paano ka hindi natitempt? 
Um, I am grounded kasi sa mga principles sa tinuro ng parents ko. Ganun, Naalala pa sila lahat. Kasi simula pa bata, ganun na kami. So kahit saan kami ilagay, I know the discipline, the values that have instilled in us will remain. Parang ganun. Wow! And pati diet mo ba? Inano nila? O ikaw lang nakaisip mo? Hindi, kasi yung, yung sa place kasi namin, walang, I mean, yung, especially yung mama ko, gusto niya lahat, gulay na lang, and ganun. I mean, so parang nasanay yung na rin yung taste buds namin. Yung mga kapatid mo kasi namin. talino mo? They are all also brilliant. Wow! <laughs> like all of us graduated valedictorian in elementary years. Nakakapik! Nakakapik na talaga ito ha. Trust. Oo. Oh, oh. Ito na. Mag, mag ano tayo? Fast facts tayo. Sige. Para mas makilala pa natin. Ayan. Ito. Ano ba yung mas favorite ng isang kagaya mo? Aso o pusa? Aso. Dago, dagat o bundok? Bundok. Araw o gabi? Araw. Letters or numbers? Numbers. Facebook or Instagram? Facebook. Sunrise or sunset? Sunrise. Mainit o malamig? Malamig. Gatas o kape? Gatas. Chicken or beef? Chicken. Adobo or sinigang? Sinigang. Leather or rubber shoes? Leather. Checkered or stripes? Stripes. Bow tie or necktie? Necktie. Sando or t-shirt? T-shirt. Boxers or brief? Brief. Favorite subject mo sa school? Anatomy. Kakaloka? <laughs> Favorite cartoon character? <laughs> Wala nga akong exposure sa cartoon characters eh. Bakit? Hindi ka nanood ng Peppa Pig? Dalawa ko lang, uh, joke lang. Hindi ka nanood ng cartoons? Kasi nung ano kami, sa lugar kasi namin, umaga walang electricity eh. Uh-huh. Oh, kaya, anong, anong kami naglalaro Sobrang sa labas? Sobrang simpleng buhay. Yes, yes. Ay, eh, eh ngayon, nanonood ka naman. Nag-social media ka ba? Uh, Facebook, Instagram. May vlog ka. Uh, okay, promote natin yan mamaya. <laughs> ano, sino favorite actress mo daw? Dito sa ano? Kahit saan? Actress? No, man. Ah, si ano? Sino ba? Catherine? Wow! <laughs> Catherine Bernardo. Uh, uh, Bakit? What fascinated you to her? Uh, okay siya. Magaling naman siya mag-act. Eh, uh-huh. yung... Alam niya kung paano i- ilabas yung emotion. Eh, marami naman sila, no? Pero, baka siya. <laughs> Ayan. Ano namang tips mo for future uh, mga magugustong maging kagaya mo? Tips. Um, first, siguro, whatever endeavors you're in, kailangan you give it your best. Kasi the Lord requires your best. Eh. And to do, to do less than that is actually a treason against Him. And failure to do good to, the, to humanity. Second, um, do not neglect to help others. Ayan, Kasi oh, minsan selfish tayo. Eh, Pero no? yung give your best sa sarili mo, teka lang. <laughs> I-work on ko pa yan. Hirap, oh. no? Kasi parang, for me kasi, excellence is just about parang um, achieving for yourself, parang topping the boards. I don't define excellence as that. I define it as parang the results that you find in the lives of other people that you've touched and changed for the better. That's so true. I agree. Yeah. Yes. And then third, um, siguro, be physically active. Be sure to achieve optimum health. Para maka, you, you can serve other people better. And Wait. for especially yung mga doctors, Practice what you preach. Kasi ang dami ko talaga. Ang dami ko friends. Mm-hmm. Nag-iyosi. Na Kaya doctors. Sana. Kaya Tapos sana. Tapos healthy pa ako. Sa nangyayon ito. Kaya sana. So, yeah. We walk the talk. Nila. Mm-hmm. Alam mo, may nakiyala nga akong cardio. Obistry eh. Natakot ako eh. Sabi ko, oh my God, hindi ko dadali dyan yung asawa ko. Obistry. Tapos nakaupo lang. Walk the talk. Walk the talk. Oh, walk the talk. Oh. And lastly, and the most important for me, make God your first, your last, and best in everything. Because at the end of the day, Excellence is parang habit, it's an attitude, a way of life with God. Galing, gusto ko yan. And i-promote mo na sino gusto mong pasalamatan, yung vlog mo, etc. Uh, gusto kong pasalamatan, syempre yung family ko. Uh, for the support, Papa Rimson, may mama Linlin, and then my siblings sa California, ate, uh, in, na sila? in New sila Zealand. Doctors ba sila doon? Uh, nurses, nurses. Uh, Baka yun ah. <laughs> and my brother, and also the family of my girlfriend, Arila family from Bukidnon. My uh, circle of friends, at saka yung family ko sa Cebu, is Design Academy, yung Mountain View College, yung college ko ng nursing, um, and the entire 70 Adventist community, sa UERM, yung mga magagaling kong professors, mga consultants and residents, sa Ex Orbi Medicus, and sa lahat ng churchmates ko, sa lahat who prayed for me. Uy, shout out pala ako sa UERM, kasi yes. kasi, oo, oh, oh, si kay Doc Benki de oh, Rosa. Oh, oh. Kaya She's my favorite love. oncologist. Thank you so much. Alam mo, uh, pinagaling niya yung yes. ano namin, my second mom, our kasambahay. So uh, talagang thank you. I love you, ERM. Thank yeah. you so much, yes, Jeff. Thank you so much for your time. And kung pwede ka nila follow my 
vlog ka ba? Yung vlog mo? Um, yung tandem, the walkers with my girlfriend in yung vlog namin. Ayan. What do you talk about there? Um, healthy living, how to achieve, Bible verses. Yeah. Hirap naman. <laughs> oh, sige. Thank you so much. Ayan mga kapatid. I hope na-inspire kayo. May replay po ito sa www.news5.com.th Sa aming YouTube account, ang hashtag Newsroom5Live. NWSRM5 Live. Yan po ang spelling yan, mga kapatid. And eto po, Newsroom 5 Talk. Ayan, yan ang segment ito. Umulit muli ako po si MJ Marfori. Have a great Monday. I hope we inspired you as much as na-inspire kami. We love you guys. Ta-ta! God bless! <laughs>